Oh, this is good. Listen to this. So all those people who have told me I'm crazy for voting for Donald Trump, I need you to tell me why I should vote for Biden. Convince me. Convince me to vote for a man who called black men presidents that can't be rehabilitated. Convince me to vote for a man who fought against busing and fought for segregation. Convince me to vote for a man who called black children roaches and said he didn't want his kids going to school with black kids because it'd be a racial jungle. Convince me to vote for that man. Convince me to vote for a man who said he was proud of the 94 crime bill and when he asked that he um, want to apologize for it, he said no, but it was one of the greatest things he done. Convince me to vote for that man. Convince me to vote for a man who said if you don't vote for him, then you're not black. Convince me to vote for a man who said all blacks think alike. Convince me to vote for a man that said blacks don't know how to use the internet. Convince me to vote for that man. Tell me why I should vote for him. Convince me to vote for a man who said that the American citizens who voted for Donald Trump was a threat to this country, yet he let the borders wide open and let anyone walk in, but we are a threat to this country. Convince me to vote for that man. Convince me to vote for a man who allowed the White House of the United States of America to be disrespected by allowing people to get nude on a soft lawn. Convince me to vote for that man. Convince me to vote for a man who allowed balloons, Chinese balloons, to circle across the United States of America and did nothing about it. Convince me to vote for that man. Tell me why he's the best person for me to vote for. Convince me to vote for a man who closed down the Keystone XL pipeline. And for all y'all who want to say, oh, it doesn't matter because that was a Canadian pipeline. Do your research because people in the United States were working on that pipeline as well. And when it was closed down, a lot of people lost their jobs. So convince me to vote for that man. Tell me why he's the best person for the United States of America. Convince me to vote for him. Convince me to vote for a man who had a debacle removal from Afghanistan, left our allies there, left our, our American citizen there, caused 13 of our service people to be killed. And when they came home, disrespected them by looking down like his watch as if he didn't have time to be there. Convince me to vote for that person. Convince me to vote for this man who stood up in a church with hundreds of blacks and told them if they didn't vote Democrat and they voted for Republicans, that they would be put back in chains. Convince me to vote for this man. Convince me to vote for this man, and I'll proudly vote for him. But you can't. You can't convince me to vote for him, because there's nothing this man has done worth voting for. This man has our borders open. More kids have died because of fentanyl. More kids have been trafficked. More kids have been raped under this man, and you want me to vote for him? This man has no security for this country, and you want me to vote for him? Convince me. Convince me to vote for this man. Okay, I'm going to still vote for Trump. Trump 2024, baby. Thank you, thank you, thank you. God bless this lady. Let me know what you think about this in the comment section. Bro, she did not miss. She listed everything, everything. But think about it for a second. The vast majority of people voting for Joe Biden are actually just voting against Donald Trump. That's all it is. Because if you ask them, why are you voting for Joe Biden? All they're saying is Donald Trump is a racist, he's a fascist, and whatever. Anyway, I'll leave you with this article from the Daily Mail. We all know what happened today with Hunter Biden, and Joe Biden came out and said that he is very proud of his son, Hunter. You cannot make this up, bro. Very proud with everything happening with his dude, not paying taxes, making money in Ukraine with no qualification whatsoever. The Hunter Biden laptop is smoking crack. He has pictures with underage girls, and then he's making money in China. This man came out and said that he is very proud of Hunter. Amazing, right? And some people out there will still vote for him. It is what it is, bro. God bless you. Let me know what you think about this in the comment section. Catch you on the next one. Wow. God bless this lady.